Man, the world is, it's, it's crazy out here, bro. It's crazy. Look, I know, I know. I've been gone for so long. I'm sorry. But it's your boy, Ford Von. Back to you guys with another video, man. Look, we got a 16-year-old Pennsylvania teen teenager charged with murder after allegedly confessing to killing a 13-year-old girl on Instagram. That's crazy. So... According to a report, investigators received a call about possible homicide. The caller told them her daughter had gotten an Instagram video call from a 16-year-old acquaintance later identified as Joshua Cooper. During the chat, Cooper allegedly said he had killed somebody and showed a person's legs and feet covered in blood. He then asked for help disposing of the body. The 911 caller said, Officer, officers went to Cooper's home where they found a, oh shit, they found the body in the bathroom, on the bathroom floor, apparently from a gunshot, a gunshot wound. Cooper allegedly fled the scene when officers arrived, but after a short search, he was taken into custody. He is charged with criminal homicide, possession of um, a weapon or a firearm and tampering, tampering with evidence. Wow. So basically, this motherfucker, I'm gonna show y'all this picture real quick. This is him. It looks, he looks like a girl. I'm assuming that's why he's uh, transgender. So I apologize to the LGBTQ plus community watching this, but uh, he's gonna have a hard time in jail. I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. But he killed a 13 year ago, a girl. So apparently, this motherfucker right here killed a 13 year old girl, right? He killed her. Call the friend on Instagram or follower. They not they said he's an acquaintance. Called the girl that uh you know mom snitched on him basically. Well she didn't snitch, she did the right thing. They ain't, that's not snitching. But he called the girl, the girl mom heard the conversation and seen the um the you know the conversation going on. You know, I guess I'm guessing the mom seen the body too, but this dumbass went online confess to the murder ask for help disposing of the body right and got called up that's it's as simple as that but 16 bro like yo I, I don't know what's going on with these kids nowadays bro but a lot of the crimes that are being committed nowadays i'm not gonna say all but a lot of the crimes are being committed by teenagers bro bro because like these parents are not raising the kids right. They're not paying attention to these kids. They feel like, oh, if I give my kid a phone, the phone will raise them and take care of them and whatnot. And then your kids see them like, being exposed to a lot of things online, like murder, fucking drugs, crime, fucking look at the TV shows we got now. It's like it's like a lot of teenage shows with sex, drugs, and murder and whatnot. And a lot of these shows are influencing kids to do stuff that they're not supposed to be doing, like crime and killing and murder and whatnot. But I, I, I have to blame the parents on this one, bro. I have to blame the parents. And he's old enough to know better, but I have to blame the parents. Because, like, where's the parents in this situation? Why Why is he with a 13 year He's 16. Why is he with a 13-year-old girl? I don't know the relationship with the girl he had, but why is he with a 13-year-old girl? That's the question, bro. When I was 16, I wasn't with 13-year-old girls. I was with girls my age. I'm just saying. So y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section, man. We got another teenager committing crime again. Murder. It's been your boy Ford, man. Like, comment, subscribe, all of that. Like, for the algorithm, comment for the algorithm. I'm out.